Florida High School Athletic Association's Board of Directors meeting this morning in an attempt to solve some of the many issues brought to their desk this spring. Some of those like mandating a basketball shot clock and name, image and likeness deals coming to high school sports in Florida. Those were tabled to a later date, but one motion did pass, which affects many of our local high school football teams, and I'll do my best to explain exactly what that is. In a unanimous 13 to 0 vote, a rural classification pilot project was passed to immediately go into effect for the upcoming 2024 football season and the 2025 season. The goal of the pilot project is to help find a solution for competitive balance in Florida high school football with some issues like transfers tilting the scales further and further each season, the same few schools winning state championships and so on. The project uses the smallest classification statewide as somewhat of a test run. The plan will be to divide the teams within the rural class into two divisions at the end of the regular season based on the state rankings, Division A and Division B, with two champions crowned. The smallest 40 high schools statewide by enrollment will be invited to compete in this rural class, and if all 40 join, there will be two 20-team brackets, with the bottom four teams in each bracket competing head-to-head -head in two play-in games for a spot in regionals. The FHSA will use this two-year period to measure a few items, including the number of running clock playoff games compared to years prior, the total margin of victory in each playoff game as compared to the past, to see if the highest seeded teams will advance to the state championships, and to see if the B Division playoff is equally as competitive as Division A.